y'all know ways for me, but I need you to get somewhere safe, okay? I want you to hide. Don't hurt me. Are you still there? The film is about this small community in East Texas where a small church felt called by God to start caring for vulnerable children. Just ordinary people looking outside of themselves, seeing the need of mankind and meeting the need. We want the ones that don't nobody else want. And they ended up adopting 77 of some of the most difficult to place children in the Texas child welfare system. 22 families want to adopt. <laughs> The whole town, the whole town wants kids now. <laughs> That's about right. When we got involved in the adoption process, we had no clue what was going on in this adoption arena. And I had to remove the kids because, well, you know, it's our job to keep them safe. Uh, she gave me these. And so what's going on in the nation right now is over 400,000 kids are in the foster system. Over 100,000 are waiting to be adopted. While we have over 400,000 local churches on every street corner sitting there lifting up the name of Jesus while this is happening under our nose. But if we can't wrap our arms around the most vulnerable amongst us, then what do we have? Noise! That's what we have. Noise. And the children can't take the noise anymore. And how do we as a community, not only the church, but how do we rally everyone to step in for kids because they are the future. For us to be able to see this, this come to fruition, this movie of their story and what it can compel other churches and other families to step forward and do the same, what this one little community can do. Imagine if all the churches around the world did the same. Would there be any kids in the foster care system, let alone, available for adoption if the church raised families up. Now I know what can happen. I, it's just not okay. And I feel like we need to show that and I feel like we need to make it known that this is what's happening and we need to make it stop. I just pray that something in this movie make your heart jump and you want to go out and be involved in the foster care crisis because people like you are people who change the world. And if you feel that tugging at your heart, don't ignore it go after it and do something. I think the ultimate thing that I take from this is you're never so small that you can't make a difference. Like, it's just extraordinary to me what we can do if we decide we're gonna make things better. I ain't never seen you so scared. Is he speaking to you? Is he speaking? <laughs>